In this example, we're going to integrate the function given here, which is x times the square root of 3x minus 1. Okay, so to do this, it's a little tricky, uh, but we're going to start by letting u be equal to 3x minus 1. Okay, and when we go ahead, when we take the derivative of u with respect to x, okay, we're going to get Okay, so we get du equals to 3dx. Okay, so actually we have du, d, we have du dx equals to 3. So we can just move the dx on the other side. Okay, so the problem here is that uh, we have this x here. Okay, and that's not in, that doesn't appear in du. Okay, however, what we can do, okay, we can go back to our u substitution and we can go ahead and solve for x okay okay so let's go down here so this is going to be uh, this is going to give us 3x equal to u plus 1 and from here we can go ahead and isolate x so x is going to be equal to 1 third times u plus 1 okay so we can so now we have x in terms of u so we can take that x uh, the expression for x that we have and replace it in for this x in our integral okay so we have the inter we have the integral of one third okay let's go back here so one third times u plus 1 times the square root of u. So we still need to convert dx in terms of du. Okay, uh, but we can do that from here. Okay, we already have that part. So since du is equal to 3 dx, this is going to give us 1 third du equals to dx. So dx is going to get replaced with one third du. Okay. Okay. So again, x is going to get replaced by one third u plus one. That was given over here. And then we have square root of u. Okay. And then dx is going to get replaced by one third du. Okay. So we have everything that we need now. So this is equivalent to uh, one ninth times the integral of u plus one times u to the one half du. Okay, so this is gonna give us one ninth times the integral of, okay, so we're gonna go ahead and distribute the u to the one half. So that's gonna give us u to the three halves plus u to the one half du. Okay, so we have one ninth times the integral of u to the three halves du plus one ninth times the integral of u to the one half du. So we can, uh, so we just apply the, uh, one of the properties for the integrals where you can distribute that integral inside the uh, parentheses, okay, over the addition. And so that's the, uh, that's using the fact that the uh, integral is a linear operator, okay. Okay, so we can go ahead and take the integral now. So we have one ninth times u to the, we add three, we add one to the three halves, so that's going to give us five halves, okay, and divide by five halves plus one ninth u to the one half plus one, which is three halves, divided by three halves. Okay, uh, go ahead and factor out one ninth. So we have uh, two times, or two fifths u to the five halves plus two thirds times u to the three halves. Okay. 
so we can go ahead and distribute redistribute the one ninth. So we're going to get two over forty five times u to the five halves plus two over twenty seven times u to the three halves. Okay, so now we can just replace u with 3x minus 1. Okay, so we're going to have 2 over 45 times 3x minus 1 to the power of 5 halves plus 2 over 27 times 3x minus 1 to the 3 halves plus some constant. Okay. Now we can simplify it from here for now, but this is this is perfectly acceptable. Okay. So this is our antiderivative, okay, of the function that we were given. Okay. Okay, so we did this by letting u be whatever you know the expression underneath the square root. And then that allowed us to solve for x in terms of u. And then from there, uh, we can uh, take the derivative of u with respect to x. That gives us the replacement for dx. Okay. And so this gives us a, an expression in all in terms of u. And then we just go ahead and apply the power rule for integration. And take the integral. And then convert everything back into terms of x. Okay.